Hello everyone, we are doing training today on the MyTel MyCollab desktop client. You will see an icon on your desktop for the MyCollab client that looks like this. When you want to launch the program, just double click on that program icon and it will launch the application bringing you right to your home screen. Your home screen consists of your inbox, which in the top part of your inbox is an area where you can add in shortcuts such as people that you call all the time that are your corporate contacts. And you can also add in other things such as speed dials for outside phone numbers that you might call all the time. Down below the inbox that you're seeing on mine, you'll see frequent activity or recent activity, such as people that might have called me, a voicemail that would have been left, or people that I might have called as well. On the left-hand side, you can see that we're highlighting it on your home screen, the little home icon. Below that, when you take your mouse and hover over that, that is your contacts. You can build contact groups. You have your personal category here, which will pull in any of your personal contacts which are found under your Outlook contact directory. So it links it up to that. And then your corporate contacts are anybody that has a phone extension on your phone system. The other icon on the left-hand side, this little icon right here when you hover over it, is your chat ability. Chatting is enabled or disabled uh, by your system administrator uh, on a company-wide basis. So if you try to chat with an individual through this portal right here, uh, you would normally have the ability, if it was disabled, it would say that your access is denied. So again, that is a system administrator feature that is either enabled or disabled. The next icon you have here that looks like a little clock, that is your call history, which will show you all of your activity normally, or it can show you any of your missed calls, received calls, or any calls you had made out. The next icon down is for your voicemail. So if you want to see if you have any voicemail messages, whether they're something that had been listened to or not, so saved or new, they'll be listed here, very similar to how it is on smartphones. And then on the top of your screen, you have an area called search or dial. So this is the area that you'll have the ability to make a phone call. So anytime you're looking to make a call, whether it's to somebody inside or outside, you would use this window up at the top to place that call. The last part that I would like to mention as an overview is where it might have your initials on the top right hand side. So on my screen, it says OT. This right here, when you click on it, will show you what your current status is set for. So for me, my current status is set for working at home and that will be something that will show in part one of the training video.